Hi everybody, Ape and Mate Jim here. I uh, want to tell you about a dilemma that we had. Uh, I was getting ready to eat breakfast. Well, she hadn't made it yet, but she was about to make me breakfast when she noticed that one of the hives was starting to swarm. So we identified it as this one over here. You see where those three nukes are? The hive right next to it, the Ape of May uh, wood hive. Uh, not the one next to my uh, four queen mating nuke. Uh, they started to swarm and they were up in the air and uh, they were still coming out of the hive and we didn't want them to swarm. So what we did was we went over there and we shut the doors on them so they couldn't get out. And then it had another ape of May box on there on the top. So we just opened it up enough for the bees to get out, not the queen, so the queen was still in the box. So what we did was we waited till they decided to settle down because now they knew they couldn't swarm. And uh, they settled on the hive and then they bearded underneath the hive and they just sat there. So after they did that, it gave us a chance to go in there and take care of uh, what we needed to take care of. First, we had to find the original queen, which was extremely hard. Uh, but then I pulled out a frame that had uh, seven queen cells on it. And uh, we could see the bees trying to get uh, one of the cells open. So we decided to, uh, uh, to help the bees. But in the meantime, we saw the original queen crawling on the frame. So we captured her, we put, in her, we put her in a queen cage. We got another queen cage and then we helped them get that virgin queen out and we caught that virgin queen and put her in a cage. And then they went to another one. You could hear the, the queen piping, the virgin queen piping. So we went to another one and we helped get that queen out. Long story short, we ended up with five virgin queens and the original queen. And we didn't want the original queen back in the box. We wanted a virgin in there. So what we did was we took, and we've got these mini mating nukes here, the lime green one and the orange one have virgin queens in there with frames and bees. This light blue one uh, over, over to the left has the original mated queen in it with frames and some of the bees that were swarming. And then the, the two next to it have virgin queens in there and with frames and we're gonna feed them. Uh, that's why we put feeders on them and I see I gotta fix that one out there, that uh, pink one. You see how it's, how the back, see the back? Okay, we gotta fix that. And we gotta fix that other one next to it. You see where, it looks like we gotta make sure that those are nothing but even where they can't get in or out. Okay, so then that ape that Ape May Wood Hive, turn it that way, that Ape May Wood Hive was three boxes high. So what we did was we wanted to break it down because uh, it had a lot second box and the third second box had a lot of honey in it. Third box they were starting to build up. So what we did was, and that's a smaller box, that's a medium box, and I had deeps on there. So what we did was we used some of the frames from the bottom box and the, and the other Apame box, and we stuck them in here to give them uh, resources and uh, frames that the original queen could lay on and uh, help out the virgins so that they already have comb for when they go on a mating flight. And we certainly do hope we get all uh, all five of them back. Uh, that's going to be excellent. We'll know in a couple weeks. Uh, and then we had three frames left over that it had honey on it. And you can see if she pans this way, you can see the bees are robbing out that, that Ape May box right there. Cause I, it's, go in the hives in, in my yard anyway, so I'll let them rob it out and because I want those frames. Uh, I want those frames clean, and they should have it robbed out by tonight. Uh, so that is where we're at right now. Uh, 
it was a long struggle because I don't know if you know how fast Virgin Queens run, but they can run fast. So we had to catch a few of them, and uh, we didn't lose one. Uh, we did open one, but uh, she wasn't uh, fully born yet. Uh, so we had to take a loss on her, but that's fine. You know, we got five virgins and the original queen, and we didn't have to <clears throat> vacuum the bees off of a, uh, off of a tree. And I think everybody looks happy. I don't know. You look, they look like they want to swarm out here, but... We'll let them calm down. Uh, we'll have to wait and see if they decide to calm down. I don't see any uh, any hives that are looking to swarm. Maybe there are. I'm certainly looking at that one right there, but I was in that one yesterday. See that uh, double nuke box? Mm -hmm. I was in that box yesterday, and I looked at the four frames there, and none of them had queen cells on them, so... Uh, you know, they're not going to swarm unless they're already raising a queen. Uh, so I guess we'll wait and see if somebody else swarms. Uh, I still got more mini mating nukes, uh, that I could put them in. That's not a problem. The only thing is, uh, excuse me, breakfast was delicious. I had chorizo and eggs. Uh, but uh, we have plenty uh, of mini mating nukes. The only thing I am out of is frames, which I got finally coming tomorrow. I got 30 frames coming tomorrow. So uh, uh, hopefully, you know, if they do swarm, and I need to vacuum them up. I got my vacuum over here, my vacuum bucket, my vacuum, uh, and my top, which has a, a screen on it. Uh, I'll vacuum them up and I'll put them in the garage uh, until tomorrow. I had to do that with one swarm. And uh, actually that swarm is in that purple box right there. And uh, yesterday I was in there. Was it yesterday or today? Yesterday I was in there. Do I have a bee on there? No. No, you sure? There's something there. No, there's no bee there. Okay, I thought I felt them crawling, but that's okay. Even if I, even, even if it was, that's okay. Uh, I went in there yesterday or today. No, yeah, it was today. I went in there today and I saw the queen on a frame, so I was happy about that because yesterday I didn't see her at all. So that's where we're at right now. Well, it looks like they're coming down. It doesn't look like they're swarming. So, <coughs> with this, we'll be back in a couple of weeks to let you know how many of those virgin queens we got to get mated and come back. Uh, now, they all have their different colored box, so they shouldn't get mixed up of where they need to go. Uh, but I appreciate you watching, and uh, like I said, we'll let you know in a couple of weeks. And keep watching my channel. It's something always exciting happening. Thanks for watching. Talk to you later.